What is happening, y'all? Well, come on back. Let's continue along. End of Kainya. Decided to travel with Anna, the Iberian girl, to protect the Raiswing Ratha egg entrusted by Guardian Ratha. Set off to Ruto Village. Are oh, we riding together? Yeah. Grab my waist. Hold tight. What's this? Catavan stand. Cool. Oh, it's the uh, Triceratops looking thing. Renopolis? Renopolis? At least Renopolis? Or am I getting my monsters mixed up? Slagtoth's okay. Slagtoth green, huh? Power beats green. Unfortunately for you, friend, I am not planning on doing elemental attacks. Damn, that move hits. Alright, Bulldrum might be leading my party. Just smashed a guy for 130. I gotta get to a blacksmith. I bet there's all kinds of stuff I can build with the Anginath parts. I can finally make a gun lance. Oh, I'm so excited. I really, I can't wait for the... Like I said in one of the other episodes, but I'm I'm really pumped about just because I I was talking about this uh, the other day on Twitter, but like when you're a content creator, very rarely do you have time to just like just you know enjoy a game for yourself, like just play something because you want to play it. Um, and you know I I need I've been looking for a new game to do that with, and I feel like stories is probably going to be that game for me because it's easy to like cover the the story quest and whatnot in episodes and there's obviously good stream content here as well but i feel like this is the kind of game i can just lay there and i can you know go after um let me see what this is real fast boost maximum hp um you know, like if I'm if I'm just going around and like hunting for dens and whatnot and fighting monsters, and I'm doing that in my spare time, I don't feel like that takes away from the like let's play episodes with a game like this because you know, you're meant to to do a little bit of grinding. So I can actually like spend time just enjoying the game and exploring and finding monsters and still make content with it, which it's 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 rare that you have that that cohesion, you know, like take something, uh, take Scarlet Nexus, for example, you know, it's hard to just sit and play that in my spare time. Cause anytime I'm playing it, unless I'm doing like side quests, uh, I'm, I'm directly advancing the story. So it makes it like a, this is just a, I play it type series whereas something like this. Anyway, anyway, point is I like having a game that I can just kind of chill with. Those are joggies. No, I don't want to fight you right now. Root bones. Nature shrooms. See Royal Ludra.
About to hatch already? Hey, is everything okay, buddy? How's the egg holding up? Oh. <laughs> it looks and smells nice and healthy. It's sure to become a claudacious Rathalos. I can't wait to meet the little guy. Yes, neither can I. Huh? Hey, what's that? The Blagiana. Oh damn, you just pick her up? Who, who was that? And what does he want with Anna? We just met her. She got kidnapped like instantly. It was actually Anna's dad. He's like, I told you not to mingle with the humans. But I looked, I didn't even notice how low I was. I did lose a heart in that, uh, the battle that I had. The Anja. Found ya! Uh, Don't worry, Anna. We're here to save you. No, wait. Huh? It's okay. Kinship stone. Red? No, of course not. This is one of Red's descendants. We met on Hakolo Island. If you just told me you were going to Hakolo Island. I've been worried sick, Anna. I thought you had been kidnapped, or even worse. Huh? What's going on? This guy's a friend of yours, Anna? Is it is her dad? Yes. He's from Ruto as well. My apologies for surprising you. I'm Alwyn. My duty is to keep our village secure. Okay. Well, well it he's looks like to the me village like chief. Might have gotten off on the wrong paw, huh? I'm Naviru, and this is my buddy, a writer from Hakolo Island. Pleased to meet you. I'll show you to the village. This way. Come. Let's go. The Kamara garb actually looks like really good in these cutscenes. I think it looks way better than the rider gear. Target spotted. The moon's blessing is with me. I don't think I've ever seen so many Wyverians in one place. I mean, in, in a lot of the main games, they're pretty reclusive. In World, they're super reclusive. Very in tune with nature.
Okay, so that's there. That's the cat hair pot. Let's do a little amiibo in. Adam and Charm, Girthy Garlic, and Mulberry Elixir. Dinship Stone, strengthening your bond with mass using Battle Bunnies levels up against the stone. This will allow you to accept more challenging subquests with better rewards. Q. Return. Okay, let's over. Right, that's the blacksmith. Let me see if they got any uh, new stuff. Weapons. Damn, look at the damage difference. Jesus. Damn, still no gun lance, bro. Why? <laughs> Give me a gun lance. Um, well, with the Anja parts, I guess. I guess I go greatsword. I mean, that is that is huge over the chicken decapitator. Like, absolutely staggering. How much is this? 7,400? Jesus. Those men is worth... Oh, wait, no. I need mid-grade ore as well. So hopefully I can find that here. Blame and Conson. Maybe I can buy something... I mean, I really want to use Gun Lance over the the bows, but like, I want, Thank you. you know, I want something that's more than just like, oh, this is an Iron Gun Lance that we leveled up twice, you know. Like, it's, it's honestly kind of surprising that I haven't found, uh, I haven't found a Gun Lance I can make with Monster Parts yet. I just need to start killing, like, everything. Quest board, what is over here? Oh, the Melnix. New inventory's been added. I mean, I might that might be my best bet getting the Red Devil. Just need sixteen. Oh, a Kukrop or Peko or whatever. Those things are crazy. Gotta find the Everden. Find the Everden. Get my bottle caps. Get my gun lance that way. And I also gotta find some mid grade ore so I can make the Anjanath sword. And then as for hammer or hunting horn, I'm not 100%, but I think I'm going to end up going hammer. So I like the idea of the hammer doing bonus damage versus status inflicted enemies. Grandfather, my apologies for worrying you, but... I spoke to Alwyn. What were you thinking running off to Hakolo Island like that? I had to keep my promise to Red. He wanted his old kinship stone taken there. And you crossed the sea on your own, just for that? Elder, Zellard, this is the rider from Hakolo Island. Naviru and Best Buddy reporting for duty. Nice to meet you, Gramps. Hmm, <laughs> so you are Red's grandchild. I do see the resemblance, I suppose. We all owe your grandfather a great debt. If there is anything we can do for you, by all means, ask. And where did you procure this? Guardian Ratha gave it to me. And then you brought it here? I had no choice. There are hunters after it. Please. Let's keep the egg here, just until it hatches. Elder, could this egg be? Indeed. 
Descendant of Red, do you know of the right of channeling? I see. So you have come here without having completed the right. <laughs> you are inexperienced as a rider and have nowhere near the power held by your grandfather. Okay, you don't need to be a dick be about it. You would not be capable of forming a bond with the monster in this egg. What? What do you know of the Wings of Ruin? Legend speaks of Razewing Ratha, a monster so powerful it can bring ruin to the world with every beat of its wings. Some even say it was such a monster that laid waste to the village that once stood on this site. So you're saying that inside this egg... It matches the description of the egg in the legend. But... Hey! Quit yanking my tail! You don't seriously believe all that! You can't just decide the monster's gonna be evil before it's even born! I know, it doesn't exactly sound fair. However... Should this Rathalos hatch and awaken to its destructive power, you will be to blame for what happens. What? Are you prepared to take that risk? It's a rider's duty to protect the egg they've been entrusted with, no matter what kind of egg it may be. As a start, let's see if the human youth has what it takes to participate in the rite of channeling. Hmm. I confess, I am curious to see what the young one can accomplish with Red's kinship stone. Grandfather. Don't sweat it, buddy! You can do this! Come on, let's get this little guy hatched! You didn't set up a house for us, let's check it out. Can I jump? No, I can't. Wait, uh, oh, here we go. Could the legend Grandfather spoke of really be true? Don't worry, Anna. It'll all work out. More importantly, we need to focus on learning about the right of channeling. Of course. The right will help prove to everyone you have what it takes to succeed. If Red could do it, I'm sure you can too. Here, Isn't right of channeling? I think that's how you swap genes between monsters. Ago. Wow! My buddy's grandpa stayed here, too? Yes. Red was the first human ever to visit Ruto Village. His coming here was our salvation, too. Oh, right! Your gramps talked about owing Red big time for something he did. <laughs> I'll tell you that story later. For now, please try to get some rest. After that, go meet Alwyn at the stables. Just like get some rest, but I don't think I actually have to do that. These are our stables. Feel free to use them as you please. Let me know if there's anything you need help with. Hey, thanks! Uh, say, where can a feline get some donuts around here? Dough nuts? What are those? <laughs> what? Don't kid around, this is important! We're talking about the greatest food in the world! I'm sorry, but I've never heard of them. A delectable treat fried in oil. They're sweet, shaped like a ring, and each bite is pure bliss. 
if you really don't know about donuts, how come you don't go nuts? <laughs> it's so stupid, dude. <laughs> Sweet, round, and fried in oil? Doesn't sound very healthy, to be honest. That's not the point. <laughs> if you've really never heard of donuts, how come you don't go nuts? <laughs> My guy's like, please. I'm not sure what you Please mean. stop, you cringe ass no, cat. No, don't you get it? Donuts? Go nuts? I'm sorry, I still don't. Okay, I guess I should stop waiting for a laugh, huh? <laughs> oh, that was a joke? <laughs> sorry, I don't really get it. Oh, man. I see. Well, as you may have noticed, our village is made up of only Wyverians. Monster riding is all we've ever known. We only started exploring the outside world fairly recently. I guess we still have a lot to learn. Sounds like you're all in the same boat. My buddy here never left Tokolo Island until now. It's your first journey away from home? That can really take a lot out of you. You should get some rest. Have any eggs? I have to do. Light and a good smell. Double attack. Let me compare them. Iron wall, rampage. Might all out compared to you, all out rampage charge. I think the main difference is they have iron wall on this one. Is there a rarity? Oh, Palu. Wild Paolumu appeared in the forest a little while back. Some of our riders were injured trying to escape. A Paolumu? But those fluff balls are adorable! How can they hurt anybody? True. Normally, they don't attack people at all. Let me guess. This one isn't normal. Indeed. This is the first time we've had to face such a threat. We'd like you to help investigate. Show us your skills as a rider. So soon? Is that wise? This should be a good experience. And what's more, the child has Red's kinship stone. This is a good chance for them to show if they are capable of taking part in the rite of channeling. I agree with Zealot. If you plan to form a bond, with Arathalos. You must hone your skills as a rider. Well, when you put it that way, challenge accepted. We'll show you what we're made of. Wait a moment, Elder. They don't have the necessary experience. Hey, whose side are you on? We took down an Anginath and not just by a whisker. You're just proving my point. That overconfidence could be your undoing. The safety of the village is my responsibility. I'd prefer it if... Relax, Alwyn. I see where you are going with this. You may accompany them. Thank you, sir. Every hand helps. Now that it's been decided, make your way to the forest. Sheesh! I still say we could have handled this on our own. Nonetheless, we'll do our best. Please be careful. Loot, lofty trees, little ways behind the village. Red's footsteps. 
Omen is now your buddy. All right. Well, looks like we know what we're going to be pushing on next. Um, I'm sure there is, like, a whole bunch of new dens and whatnot for me to explore. And since we're in a whole new locale, in theory, there should be a bunch of new monsters as well. This item quiz? Makes a monster more likely to retreat. Paintball. Well, flying monsters. Flash bombs. Deals damage to monsters regardless of their hardiness. Q. So. Alright, well, we're gonna wrap things up here for now. We have a whole world ready to explore. So, um, next episode, we're going to be heading on out, taking a look for that Hollow, Malu. And uh, yeah, sounds good. So, stay tuned. I'll catch y'all soon with more Monster Hunter stories, too.